Welcome back. Time for part two of my Animal Crossing Villager Species. Let's go. Alrighty, first up is the gorillas, with my favorite being, well, weed. I personally think that the gorillas are mediocre. I think they're better than a, what, what a lot of people said, but yeah, I don't really like them. I, I like Bweed, Caesar, Jane, and Peewee and Louie, but the rest are just, yeah, no. Especially Rilla and Boone. Yeah, no. Either way, solid C tier. Not really a fan. Next up is the hamsters. Who are, I'd say, are pretty good. I'd actually say they are really good. Not S tier, but definitely A tier worthy. I really like, my favorite obviously is Marlo, the, the gangster, or the mobster, hamster, but the rest of them I'd say are really good. Well, with the exception of Graham, they're all good. Yeah, no to Graham. I like Rodney, Hamlet, and Apple, but the rest are, yeah, no. Or no, well, but Graham is, yeah, no. The rest are okay, though. Oh, and I'll also say that I like Hamfrey. He's also really cool. So, yep. I'd say an A tier. Next up is, well, the hippos. Another A tier species, if you ask me. Now, the hippos are definitely one of the most more underrated, but if you ask me, one of my more unpopular opinions is that the hippos are a better version of the rhinos, if you ask me. I'd say with the exception of Rocco and Bubbles, I like all the hippos, especially Hippo, which is the one here, Harry and Biddy. They're all awesome. Although Bubbles drags them down, I'd also say I like Bertha and Biff. With the exception of Rocco and Bubbles, they're good. I'd argue that with Bubbles, they I'd argue that Bubbles makes them go down to A tier, but still a solid species. Definitely a high A tier, if you ask me. Next up is the horses. Now I'd say that the horses are also, man, we've been getting a lot of slam dunk species recently. Well, the last three. But the horses are also awesome. My favorite being Cleo. The only two that I dislike or that I have any issues with are Clyde and Peaches. And it's pretty much because of their eyes. Like, what happened to them? But the rest are good. Yeah, I like, I like Poppy, I like Victoria, I adore Cleo, as you guys can see here. Yeah, Roscoe is also good. So yeah, oh yeah, and Winnie also. Yeah, definitely awesome. Oh yeah, there's also Ed, there's also Colton, there's also Annalisa. Yeah. And, and there's even, I'm pretty sure, at least one cut horse that I forgot. That I forgot about. Yeah, there's plenty of cut hippos that I forgot about. Oh yeah, Holden with the hamsters. Yeah, I also like Holden. Pretty sure from what I know of, he's the most recent, like, non-amiibo cut villager. So yeah. Don't quote me if I'm wrong on that, though. So yeah, so horses, if you ask me. Oh yeah, Julian. How could I forget about Julian? Yeah, Julian as well are definitely an S tier. Awesome. Oh, 
Oh, now the kangaroos. If I'm going to be entirely honest, this is my second favorite species. Right behind the bears. And I honestly find it so adorable how the moms of the of the kangaroos have their joeys in their pouches. I find it really cute. It's like having a little mom on your island. I wish that they had I wish that they had like a transgender kangaroo or like a guy that has a has a, a joey in his pouch. I'd find that really cool. But either way, the kangaroos are awesome as well, I'd argue. Walt is my favorite villager in the entire species, or in the entire series. I had a great time with him when he was on my island. And look at how cool he is. He's awesome. Uh, yeah, definitely my favorite, and... So yeah, so enough enough with me blabbering. I'm putting the kangaroos in S tier. I'd say that they're actually they are my favorite like species when it comes to like design wise, but the problem is that the bear it, it's kinda like how how Nikachu explained it. It's like would you rather have like have like ten ten regular cookies or ten chocolate chip cookies it's like it's like yeah or, or three chocolate chip cookies but ten regular less good cookies yeah the chocolate chips are better but there's more of the of the regular ones so i'll take the regular ones that's kind of like what it is between the bears and the kangaroos for me honestly they're just more bears and there's more bears that I like, so I'll put them higher. So I prefer the bears. Next up is the koalas. Ozzy honestly carries this species, if you ask me. He, he was my first ever lazy in Animal Crossing, and I adore him. Pretty sure him, Gonzo, and Sydney are the only ones that I like. But the rest are like, eh. Oh, and also Faith. But the rest are like, eh. Yeah, I'd say this is like a B-tier species. But they are carried by Ozzy, honestly. Yeah, the ones that I don't particularly care for, like Alice, Eugene... Yeah, and I'm pretty sure there's like a cut koala that I don't care for. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like Sunny or whatnot. Whatever her name was. Yeah. Don't really care for them. But Ozzy alone brings them up to a B, if you ask me. Yep. There's a lot of, I'm getting a lot of B tier villagers, which I guess makes sense. Considering B is like the median. Next up is the lions. The only gender specific species. Well, the kangaroos were gender specific with only females before Rooney and Walt were introduced. But so far, there's only been male lions from what I know of. Which is unfortunate because it would be nice to see some lionesses. But either way... I personally like the lions. Yeah, like, I like Leopold. I like Elvis. Elvis is my favorite. And I also like Rex. There's some others that are just okay. But I'd say on average, they get a solid B tier. Just a, just a decent, probably like a high B tier as well. Probably, they're probably going to be like the, the dogs and the ducks and get like a high B tier. Next up, we have my, definitely a bottom five species for me. It would be, well, the monkeys. It's because I like Flip, Monty, and Tian Shang are okay. But the rest are just meh to know, honestly. Oh, 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 Champ is also okay, if you ask me. 
Unfortunately, they had to cut Champ because of Porter, I'm pretty sure I heard. But yeah, but the monkeys, like, I don't really care for Nana. Simon, just no. Yet Sh Sherry is just also no. Yeah, not really a fan of the monkeys. Although I will, will say that Tian Shang's design is cool. Definitely a nice addition with that one to the new update. But yeah, I'm, this is kind of like the opposite with the elephants where I'm teetering between F and C tier. I think for now, I don't think they're as bad as the cats or the anteaters, but I think for now, I'm probably going to put them at like a low C tier, honestly. Ooh, the mice. Now, the mice. The mice. What do I think about you guys? Well, obviously, Limburg is my favorite. I just like his name and his overall aesthetic. I just think that he's he's cool. He's like he's like a homeless man mouse. <laughs> With a little smile. Yeah, the other mice that I like are Samson. I also like Bella and Dora. Oh yeah, Penelope. Oh yeah, and Bettina. There's also, yeah, there's definitely some good mice out there. I'd also argue that Shatter is also that tier. And also Bettina, no, Anacati. I, I like Anacati, although her green is a bit weird. I like her. I remember I got her for an island of mine, and she's decent. Yep. But the only mice that I don't really care for are probably, like, Greta. Not really a fan of her or whatnot. Yeah, and also Moose. But I'd say that overall I'd give the mice probably like a high B tier or a low A tier, honestly. And... Oh yeah, Petrie is also good. Yeah, I'll give them a low A tier, honestly. Well, partially because I think they deserve it, and also partially because, well, B tier is kind of getting crowded. <laughs> Next up is the Octopodes. Now, the Octopodes are one of the smallest species in the game, with only like five members, I think, in which one of them not, isn't even in New Horizons. Yeah, Inkwell, unfortunately. Yeah, but I'd say that it's like, it's literally e either hit or miss or in between with them. <laughs> say, Octavian is a hit, Zucker is a miss, and Inkwell, Marina, and Cephalaba are in the middle for me. Just a perfectly even species. Honestly. Still, I'd say that they're like, probably like a high, a high C tier because they're just overshadowed by other species that I would call better than okay overall. So yeah, that's probably where gonna, I'm going to put it, but I'll definitely rearrange them to be higher in C tier, honestly. Yeah, sorry, you got nothing against the octopuses, or no, o not octopuses, octopodes, but they're definitely lacking when compared to other species. Yeah, sorry guys. Next up we got the ostriches, with my favorite obviously being Phoebe. I mean, she's a freaking phoenix, come on. Then there's, I'd also argue that... Really, there aren't really that many great ostriches, but there aren't really any bad ones either. I'd say that the ostriches are actually probably one of the most forgettable species for me. I just honestly always forget their existence. Which you'd get why, because the only two ones that I really care for are like Rio and Phoebe. The newly, yeah, the brought back for Rio. And there might also be, a, like, one other that I'm forgetting, which 
I mean, if I'm forgetting, then, you know. But, yeah, but other than that, I'd say that they're, like, okay. Or above average. They got some decent members, but the rest are just okay. I think that they're, they're definitely, I'm pretty sure they're just slightly better than the Octopodes. So I'm probably going to put them in, like, a low B tier. Yeah. I think that that's a fair replacement for my opinions on them. Next up we got the penguins. Oh, I like the penguins. I do agree with people that they probably have one of the weirder designs. Like, I know that penguins aren't stick thick in, in real life. Or aren't like tree limbs in real life. But like... The, the game made them like bean bags. Like, look at them. I think that's goofy. Yeah, but either way, I'd say that the penguins are overall good. Like, probably A tier good. Like, low A tier good. Yeah, you got Hopper, who I'd say is one of the best villagers in the game. You also got Wade, who is good. Sprinkle, who is good. Friga is also really good. Yeah, I'd say that there's definitely a lot of, like, okay villagers in here. Like, and just forgettable ones, which pushes it out of S tier. And into, like, low B, A tier. But I'd still say that overall, they're good. Low A tier. Next up, we got the pigs, like an okay species, or no, above average species, or good species, almost good. The pigs, a lot of people dislike the pigs, but I'd say that they're decent. My favorite is obviously Peggy, she was my first ever peppy villager in New Horizons, and I really liked her. I also like her simple design. I also have an aunt that has the same name as her, Aunt Peggy. That also raises her points. I definitely really like her. The rest, I like I like Boris. I also like Gala. I'd also argue that I'd like Q and Shops. But like Rasher, eh. Yeah, and uh, Spork. Meh. I think this is gonna be like a like a mid to maybe like low B tier, honestly. Yeah. Although B tier is getting a bit over flooded, did yeah I'm giving B giving them a B tier. Next up, oh, this is definitely a good one. The rabbits. The second most popular species in the entire game. Or at least in New Horizons. I do find it quite unfortunate that both the cats and the rabbits have, well, the most, or the most popular species when it comes to villagers. Because I think it's honestly was a bit of a waste of designs. Considering how similar their designs are, but either way, they're still good. I adore. I really like Tiffany Hopkins. is awesome. I love his like. I love his like blue inflatable design. I love his like gamer RV. As you guys can see, I like his name. I also share a birthday with him, and he even has a Wii U in his RV. Awesome. Yeah, he definitely is. As, a, as an S tier villager for me, even without the species in consideration. But the rest of the species is also good. You got Gaston, Francine, Chrissy. Yeah. Really solid species. The only thing that's keeping them from. They're definitely like a high A tier, but the only thing that's keeping them from. Like. S tier to me is, to me is there is there's some definitely some like filler like Gabby Pippi, yeah some like mediocre ones. Oh, and I also can't forget about the new Sasha. 
he is pretty cute. And also unique. He's the only male villager with the fashion hobby I heard of. Definitely a high A tier. I also just noticed that I'm kind of running out of recording time on my phone. So um, these last few species or last some species, I might go through a bit quicker. The rhinos, as I said with the hippos yesterday, are just like... A worse version of the hippos. Like I don't care for. I don't like Spike. I don't care for Rhonda. There's some okay. Cut. Want, cut. The cut rhinos. My favorite's probably a tie. Between Meringue and Hornsby. I know it's a normie pick. But they're freaking cute. Look at her. Either way. Although they're good. Or. I like them. The rest of the species just drags them down to like mid to high C tier. Yeah. Sorry guys. Next up we got the sheep. The sheep are like Decent, I'd say. I like Etois, you know, the San Rio villager that's on the screen right now. And I'd also say that I like Dom as well. But, oh yeah, Cashmere. I also like Cashmere and that she's like a witch. I really like that design as well. Yeah, and, and there might be a couple of others that I'm forgetting, but there's... But the rest are like honestly okay to forgettable, which is why I'm probably going to put them in like B tier, yeah. I honestly forget about Willow, or... God, what's her name? Freaking... Crap, I forgot her name. Yeah, I honestly forgot about... Forget, yeah. If I honestly forget about... Yeah, oh yeah, Vesta, I also forget about... Yeah, and Stella. So yeah, B tier. Oh, now here's an easy S tier. The squirrels. The squirrels, Sylvana being one of my favorite villagers in the entire game, are pretty much everyone can agree that they're a slam dunk species. The only ones that I don't care for are Sally and Hazel. But the rest are, are awesome. Or are good. You got Ricky, Static. You got Caroline. You got, as I mentioned, Silvani. You got Tasha. Yeah. Oh yeah, Marshall also. I think Marshall is kind of a bit overrated. But I could definitely agree with him being pretty decent. So overall, good species. If you ask me. Next up with. Next up you got the wolves. The wolves. Are also another good species. They're probably one of the most popular species. In the entire franchise. And honestly. I don't blame people. Because they are also really great. Yeah Whitney. Because. Whitney is one of my friend's favorite villagers, so she definitely bumps them up. I also just like her design. It's also freaking cool. Yeah, you also got Wolfgang. You also got Kyle. You also got Chief. You also got Sky. You also got Adi. You also got Vivian. Yeah, you also got and some others. The only ones that I particularly don't care, the only one that I don't care for is probably like Dobby. But I'm not really into the old man style he's got. But I can definitely see why he has his fans. And I respect the opinions. Definitely like a solid, like a high, a mid to high A tier. Next up we got the Tigers. Which I also just realized that I accidentally put the Tigers after the wolves sorry about that 
either way the tigers are just okay i'm kind of yeah i like rowan and i really like bangle but the rest are like okay and some are just like eh bringing them down to b but so far this is what i've got now there's definitely some arrangements that i do to this first off okay let, let me just do some arrangements quickly I'd say B tier looks good. And then and then just move my kangaroos to my third favorite. And the deuce to my third favorite. And 